and queen. Hi guys, welcome back to another video. If you're new, hi, what's up? This is Josiah. He is my four-year-old son and I am Jarima and we are about to do a wash day. He has to wash his hair. He has thick, long, beautiful hair like his mom. And as you can see, we're gonna use this, um, what do you call this? Like a visor for your head. If your kids do not like washing their hair, this is the best purchase ever for washing your kids hair Josiah does not like washing his hair you could already see he's getting like a little fussy see he's putting it back because he does not like washing his hair he knows once I pull that out is wash day so I just found a little braid left in his hair we're about to take that out and then start the process Josiah does not like washing his hair up he really doesn't like the feel of like a lot of water falling down on his face like he does i don't i don't know <laughs> i really don't know because sometimes this child love water but i guess he just don't like it on his face and in his hair and his eye and stuff the visor literally blocks everything like that visor i didn't think it was gonna work that good because i seen i forgot why seen people using it but it there's like a hard plastic one this one is more foam there's like a hard plastic one that I've seen people using and I'm like, do not hurt the kid's head. So I was so glad when I ordered it and I saw like it was like foam and not hard plastic. But this is a lifesaver. It literally do not like you. You can like throw water all over the head. No water gets on their face. So this is like really good. You can get this from Timu, Amazon, anywhere. And it's cheap. It's very, very cheap. I don't remember the exact price guys, but it's cheap. So once you click the little buttons in the back to size it to your kid's head, the little flaps, you have to line them up come um, over the ears because that's going to stop the water from going on the ears. The band itself stops everything from coming in, but the little air part is just like an extra, you know, support. Yeah, this is so funny. Like, look at his face. He's just expecting the worst. This child is so funny. So here y'all can literally see once I pour the water on his hair, none is on his face. Like no water whatsoever on his face. We just gonna use this shampoo. This is not what I usually use on his hair, but this is like a backup for when we out of our main shampoo. Right now what I'm doing is like I section his hair off in parts and I try to comb it out just to make it easier on him and me when it's time to like fully detangle his hair before braiding. So yeah, while the shampoo's in, I comb it with the white heat comb and I also do this, I think after I put the conditioner in, I do this as well just to like, you know, less pain on him and less work for me <laughs> uh -huh. 
and this way i can also feel comfortable knowing that his hair is getting clean from the root all the way to the tips of his hair so yeah this is definitely something that i recommend and i did to my own hair when i had natural hair and there's no damage has been done i know some people think like oh it breaks it does nothing bad to your hair it actually helps it and when you're actually um braiding your hair and combing through your hair you see there's like less hair loss that this thing works like not a drip of water on his face and now he's so comfortable it's like he's just watching his tablet and just like you know singing along like this is like a miracle whoever thought of this is such a brainiac This is a conditioner to the shampoo that we actually use. I use this on my hair, Josiah's hair. It is called I Am Free by Jas. She's on Instagram. You can look her up, I think, by the same name I just said. But she is like an all natural. Um, it's more for alopecia. I use it because I feel like I have it on my hairline. Like my hairline is damn gone. <laughs> So I use her products. I don't use it as consistent as I should, but in one point in time, I did. Before I had Josiah, I used her products real heavy and I was seeing a change in my edges. My edges was like getting thicker. You know, I was using her whole shampoo, conditioner, scalp, serum, oil. But like I said, it's all natural, so it's not cheap. You're paying for the quality basically. So it's braiding time. I just let his hair air dry a little bit. It's still a little damp, so we're gonna go through it with the blow dryer, which he hates. This child hates a blow dryer. Like he the same sound the vacuum makes. He doesn't like the vacuum either. So those are like similar items to him. Like he doesn't like any of those sounds. his hair i'm gonna part it into sections and we're gonna do it piece by piece we're not gonna do it all at once because then it's just gonna hurt it's gonna hurt regardless but you know when you section it off and do it piece by piece it's less pain i'm gonna share another product that i got from amazon that i found that 
is very good for detangling your kids hair and it doesn't hurt like you put this in your kids hair all over and comb through it and it's like way less pain it makes the pain go from a eight to a four literally it takes away half of the pain probably even more than half like this is like the best thing ever best moisturizer it's like a leave-in conditioner it moisturizes your hair but it also helps de with the detangling process like a lot
right so we're done blow drying the first half we're gonna do the second half off camera because it's gonna be much quicker and out the way so we'll be right back all right guys so we're all done with the blow drying process as you can see a little bit of hair loss like i said and this time i'm gonna try to use this strong gel styling gel that i used to retwist my locks i'm gonna try to use it on his bridge and see if they last longer
y'all just like me the middle of the middle and top of Josiah head is very sensitive I have that same problem so I know it looks like he's in so much pain but it's just because that um, area of his head is already like so sensitive So since we're done with this side, we're gonna do the other side off camera. So we'll be right back. Boom, so we done. And I'm about to use this scalp oil, like I told y'all, on his hair. Actually, the scalp oil that came with this bottle is done. And I just filled it up with some Jamaican castor oil. So that's what I'm using, Jamaican castor oil on his scalp. And yeah, that's the best thing. disclaimer y'all i am not the best most professionalist breather that's not even a word but i'm not the best breather my parts ain't always you know super straight but i gotta get a job done okay all right <laughs> but we finally done y'all and this is the ending results of my baby boys wash and braid vlog so don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. You don't have to comment. I always say just like and subscribe to our channel. And yeah, see you in the next video. Bye.